Hi guys, so Mina is visiting me for the weekend. She's staying in my dorm and she brought me some bagels from New York. Now we have matching adventure shorts! It was going to be my birthday the week after, so Mina brought me my birthday gifts. So cute, I love them so much. So I took Mina to the Boston Public Library first thing in the morning, which is the nicest time to go because there's no one and it's so pretty. Right outside the Boston Public Library, there's a farmer's market and it's so cute. For lunch, we went to this Japanese restaurant on Newberry Street, and this sushi was the best sushi I've ever had. It was so good. What did you get? <laughs> For how much? So we got on these blue bikes, I think it was $2.95 for like 30 minutes and it was honestly so nice to ride around the city. We went to the northeastern area and met up with Tin and Wit. They're visiting from Penn State. Hi guys, so right now we're walking to dinner. We're, we're having dinner at Seaport. The food was quite good. It was my first time trying oysters, but I did not like the oysters. <laughs> Everything else was pretty good though. We walked over to Quincy for dessert and got chocolate covered strawberries. So Mina and I went to the Isabella Gardner Museum, but it was sold out, so we walked over to the Tufts SMFA campus um, and had a little tour of the exhibition. Then we walked over to the Museum of Fine Arts. You can get a ticket for free if you go to a college in Mass or if you hold a Bank of America card. They close at 5 and it's like 4.45. 4.15, we have 10 minutes. Okay, let's go. Oh my god, it's him! Oh my god, it's me. You saw me yesterday. <laughs> so fake. But, does the, the vlog know that I'm above average? In what? Then we had dinner at my favorite Thai restaurant, Thai Basil. Um, we, it was a little high school reunion moment. We had Meg coming in from Bowdoin, Mina from New York, Tin and Wit from Penn State, and it was just such a great time. And of course, the rest of us, we were already in Boston, but we just came together. It was so good. Then how was the food? It was good. I got a Thai. It was so good, right? We all came back to M's apartment, and we played this game. Game. It was so funny. This is a gift that Tin got for everyone. So cute! <laughs> Tin got
got me a projector for my birthday. Thank you, Tin. And then I also got these cookies from Wit Tin Folk Taya and Manau. Thank you, guys. I love you. <laughs> hey, guys. We're at Mew. We're gonna go to a rat. It's Mina and I's first time. And Posh is taking us. After that, we walked over to this restaurant. If you're from Bu, you probably know where this is. But yeah, it was pretty good, I guess. So, do you want to rate that? I rate it <laughs> 85 out of 10. The packaging is really cool. The packaging is a 10 out of 10. Yeah, like you can feel the the bumps. The smell is a 10 out of 10. The smell it smells like Swedish fish, but it does not taste like the Swedish fish. It starts to taste like Swedish fish after a day. Act small. I said small. So there was this booth in front of Muji. It was like a lucky spin thing. Um, it was on Newbury Street, and yeah, I love coming to Newbury Street on Sundays because they shut down the roads and you can just walk on the roads and there's just booths everywhere and it's so cute. Oh no! We got a free notebook, we got a um, pen, and then a 10% off thing. This bridge to MIT is probably my favorite place to walk. It is always so nice, the view is amazing. And also this sidewalk pathway along the river always has great spots, it's so nice. No, it's not. Yes, it is. We met up with Posh and Plurin at this Japanese Thai restaurant, and it was really good. Really good seeing Plurin for the first time in a while, too. So this is the next day, and the last day of Mina's day and the vlog. So we decided to try sweet greens for the first time, because Posh is actually obsessed. We got that. Cheers!